What's going on YouTube? It's Gone in 60 here back with another video. It is Saturday, the weather is amazing outside, so I thought, hey, let's shoot a few videos. So today I'm gonna share with you guys a tip that I've been using for years. So many of you maybe have had scratches or swirls in your instrument cluster in your car, and today I'm gonna show you a quick product that will actually remove those out of your car very easy and very effectively. So thanks for watching guys, stay tuned, and uh, we'll jump right in. product we're going to be using today. It's Plastics by Meguiar's. Uh, this is safe for clear plastic. Um, it helps cleans, it helps polish, it removes kind of cloudiness or yellowness, oxidization, um, and fine scratches. You can actually use this on your headlights when they kind of become really fogged or kind of yellow or not clear. Um, it's it, I wouldn't say it's the best or the longest lasting for headlights. Uh, if you are going to do um, kind of like a headlight restore. I actually recommend Turtle Wax. Uh, they actually have a headlight restore kit where you actually kind of sand the headlight down and polish it. That lasts longer, but this will make the headlights immediately look clearer, but they will eventually kind of go back to how they were after some time. But when it comes to instrument clusters, this is what I've been using for years that works really best to get those scratches or swirls out. Uh, I'm actually going to throw up uh, a picture right now just so you guys can kind of see a scratch that I caused in my instrument cluster. I only had the car for a couple months and I actually caused this scratch in it and it was actually from a microfiber towel. You guys are probably like, why would a microfiber towel scratch uh, your instrument cluster? But a lot of microfiber towels have really kind of sharp edges on them um, and well, I shouldn't say sharp edges, but they have an edging and so if you, if you catch it wrong or if there's a bit of dirt under there, so I really only recommend um, edgeless microfiber towels um, because they're a lot safer to be honest. Um, the ones that have the edges, sometimes if you press just right or if you have something under it can scratch it. And so uh, today I'm going to show you guys how we can remove that. So I don't know how well you guys can see, but you can see I have a couple marks that honestly this frustrates me um, that I caused those on there, but I really did it with just a microfiber towel. I was not scrubbing that hard. But anyways, we're going to try and get them out today. So hopefully you guys can kind of see what I'm working with uh, here. And so we will go ahead and apply it. Um, in terms of application, I really just apply a small amount to a foam applicator pad or just a terry cloth towel. Um, you know, this says one headlight at a time, but we're not doing headlights. We're actually just doing the instrument cluster. So we're just going to rub it on thoroughly. Don't press too hard. Um, and then just wipe off kind of the residue like you would a wax. So really easy to use. Okay, so I've kind of folded up my microfiber towel. I've shaken the bottle, so I'm just going to apply some product um, on here. That's probably more than enough. I'm just going to kind of just damp it into uh, the edges here so it doesn't come on uh, too, too heavy. And then really I'm just going to take this and just lightly kind of apply it across all of this. All right, so you can see it kind of just leaves just this white haze on there. Uh, I recommend you might need to do this just a couple times uh, to kind of get the desired results that you need. Obviously, if a scratch is too deep, uh, it just, it won't fix it. It won't make it better. So we'll see what kind of scratches I'm dealing with. We'll see if it comes out, uh, but I'll show you guys kind of what it looks like as I polish it off. Oh, my 
bluff, I won't pick up, I let it ring. Record your voice so I can listen back again. Okay, gonna share with you guys the finished results here. I did apply um, a couple coats, a couple applications to it. So just want you guys to kind of be able to see uh, what it looks like. Um, it removed a lot of the really, really fine scratches. And even the deeper ones, what you'll notice is when you're driving is where I used to be able to um, really see them really well. Um, you won't be able to see them from your driving vantage point. Uh, I did have a couple that it just, it just, it helped, but I wouldn't say, you know, it made them kind of shorter based on kind of where the longer scratch is a little bit uh, skinnier. Uh, but you can just kind of see in the reflection, there's just still a couple really minor uh, scratches. They're a little bit deeper. Um, I wasn't able to get those out, but my instrument cluster does look a lot cleaner. So this is really good for light scratches or just kind of swirl marks. The older your car gets, the more you've cleaned it, you probably just see kind of some cloudiness or some light hazing, but your visibility will be really good after you use this product on there. So not the best for deep scratches. I really don't know um, anything that gets deeper scratches out of instrument clusters. Uh, maybe you guys might have some recommendations. I would love to hear them. Um, but now I can drive down the road peacefully and not always kind of be staring at that same scratch that was there. So anyways, guys, thanks for watching today's video and uh, hope you guys stay safe and have a great weekend.